Hello friends, we just got off of work. It is date night and that means Bobby and I are gonna go drink some wine, eat some food, and we're gonna bring you along to kind of show you what a little night in Italy in Chicago is like. We're gonna go get changed though. I look a little bit oily from wearing a mask all day. Let's pick the outfit and do a little bit of makeup. So I don't really know what the vibe of this place is. So we'll go like casual, cute, but we'll see. We'll try it on and let me know what you think. I'm a big fan of this little shirt guy. It's like kind of sleeveless, a good neutral. And I was thinking of putting this leather jacket over it. It's cute. It's getting pretty warm here now, so we might just do the jacket. I've been kind of sweating recently walking around in my winter coat. The only thing is I don't have blue jeans, and I don't know if blue jeans are fancy enough. I really want to wear my like dad jeans. Let me show you them. I got these from Hollister a little bit ago. They were $10 and I'm, obs ooh, pit stains. I'm obsessed with them. They like are loose and barely touch my body and that's what I want in a jean. I don't want it anywhere against my skin. The only thing is this whole, I'm wondering like if this is a nicer establishment, will this be okay? Like maybe if it was like darker, and no holes, we'd be okay. I don't know. I don't know. I do have a little bit more of a straight leg jean though that we could wear. I think we might just go with that. Pair with some like gray boots. But well, apparently it's a 90 minute standing event. So I want to be comfortable, but boots should be fine. I really want to wear my white sneakers, but those have seen the end of time and they're really gross. <laughs> so I don't know. We'll see how I'm feeling. I forgot how much of a crop girly she is. These are my joggers. Wow. And I'm, this is sometimes how I pick clothes is if I know I'm going to be bloated because we're going to be drinking lots of different types of wine, probably eating lots of cheese, which Depending on the day, my body will see how it likes it. And then probably lots of bread. So I'm like, also from like a warmth standpoint, I don't know if we're ready for this yet. End of March. I think we might just go a high-waisted black skinny jeans. Cause then it'd be cohesive. Maybe, well, we'll still try in the jeans and see. So there has been a recent update. Apparently it is raining, so we will not be wearing anything white. So the entire ensemble is about to change. So the updated fit. <laughs> and we'll do the jacket over okay? Woo! We have these cute little scamly in the earrings. Last time, I probably been to a wine tasting was in 2020 before the pandemic. And Binnie's. And Binnie's wine tastings. Quite good. We have the rings. That are losing their color because I get them wet and I buy cheap rings. I lose them all the time. These were on the spot. Minimal makeup. I hope everybody reads the watches. I'm like kicking myself because I never got into makeup when I was younger. And now I feel like I have this like huge learning curve. But I've watched a ton of videos, so I'm like conceptually I understand, right? We'll practice though. Could use some work. I'm really excited to see 
the different types of sommeliers there. I don't know if there are different types, but they always know so much about wine. I like to think I know some, a little bit, like knowing the basic reds and whites and how those are different. But beyond that, working for a good time. I've been seeing the Selena Gomez lip oil advertisements all over my TikTok feed. I feel very influenced because I don't like lipstick because it gets on my teeth. I feel like easily. But I've been seeing these and I'm like, oh. So overwhelmed by all the products out there. But I just don't buy new ones. And last of all. Okay, but what are these? They're so long. Oh my god. Yes, this is what we are here for. Lactose intolerance food. Nice. <laughs> Quite tasty. The pinot. I don't know which one this one is. No, you can get it. You can get it. I don't know which one this is. That's the other one I love. Out of ten, what are we? A fluffy crust. Here we go. You can give it like a seven. Seven votes. Seven. And that felt generous. Let's try the other one. I'm so excited to try. We'll say five and a half. Status update. Six wines in. I'm kind of feeling. Shout out to Gabby. This is some type of bruschetta. Marcotta, a corn of verdure, and rochetta con pesciere. Yeah. Alrighty. Trying the bruschetta. <laughs> what is on top? Why is it green? Oh, my teeth. <laughs> kind of like, this tastes like peas. It might be. Do we think this is peas? It may be. Try this next. That's just mozzarella, right? Mm -hmm. Mozzarella, everyone. You're welcome. This has been the best thing so far. Cheese. <laughs> we have some type of meat and cheese. Let's try the cheese. I love cheese. I need so much cheese. And then, what did you say? Salami. Salami. <laughs> it's a little fatty. I'm not the biggest fan of fatty. It's good salami. Okay. But the cheese. <laughs> this is something, this is something that's chocolatey. Look at these cute little ravioli.
really skip to dessert. There are peas in that. Why are there so many peas? This popular outfit. Showcasing Italy's finest. Peas. <laughs> we're on... We're on 10. I think this is line 10. We're feeling. So just try to... Look at this. The legs. Full body. Phenomenal taste. Tastes like southern Italy, kind of coast, on the beach. Uh, we'll just see what happens. It's very it's dry. Red. It's red for sure. My hair is a mess. Oh, I like this one. I like this one. That's good. That's slaps. That's also red. <laughs> what is Joe Biden doing about the wage inequality gap with wine pours? Just a more social guy. Joe Biden. You gotta talk up. Waiting for your you gotta response. talk up the tenders, people. We see this inequality right here. Social show your show your glass. You show your you're covering your glass. I'm not. I'm sure this is the gender the gender gap. Because I was a nice gender guy. Gender wage gap. Nice guy. Joe Biden. Nice waiting guy for Biden. your response. We've got some orange, 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 orange a la ragu, and zucchini bread. Have the wagyu. This is wagyu. Oh, okay. Wagyu, not wagyu, brother. Oh, wait, they're giving us wagyu? Oh, my God. We should be paying more. That's good, though. And we have our, our food. Cheers. Cheers. Yeah. This is a good way to iron. These are so warm. So we got a cannoli. Yeah. The I try. Yeah. Sorry, give me one second. Oh, this is. Cool. I think I saw it again. Okay. Delicious. They are not messing around with the desserts. A wellness check. We're on Narrow. Number 18. Are you on 19? You get more than me. I mean, I got a fat pour early. That's true. And we're, we're feeling good. We're back. <laughs> we're, it's good. Yeah, There's 18 is as good as about six was. They are starting to blend, except for the white wines. Tapping out at 19. Bobby's tapping out at 20. We're still going. Just kidding. So we're ending the night. I had about 20 different wines we tried. I think Bobby had um, 21, 22, but feeling good. We're gonna watch some Iowa, South Carolina. Iowa. <laughs> we're, trying to, we're trying to win the game right now. We're gonna watch some Iowa, South Carolina basketball. Go Hawks. We may be Purdue's in this family, but we stand the Big Ten. I think we found it. Go Hawks. And I hope everyone's safe. I heard there were really high winds in Chicago area, so I hope you're all safe. Um, and take care of yourself. Let me show you guys the final fit. I forgot to take it beforehand. This is the fit. All right, that's enough of that. Hope you enjoyed. We'll catch you next time. Bye, stay safe, and take care of yourselves.